Hi, Ben of Buffaloes. Hi, Mrs. Sibilia. Hi, Mrs. Sibilia. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Wembley. Hi, Ms. Hankus. Hey, did you know that the focus for this week is compassion? I did. Did you know that compassion means that we care about others and we treat them with kindness and we feel a strong desire to help people in need? Compassion is basically empathy in action. Speaking of compassion, are you okay, Mr. Wembley? You okay? Yeah. Well, I had a rough morning. This morning, I was getting my cereal ready and it was Trix, which is my favorite, and my kid made me give it all to him. And I love yeah. Twix. Oh, yeah, tricks are for kids. Yeah, that's a good one. I'm sorry, yes. Mr. Wembley. Yeah, me too. You know what will probably make you feel better? What? The Bennett staff video on compassion. Let's take a look. Good morning, Bennett Buffaloes. This is Mrs. Diaz. And this is Miss Oliveira with a few words of wisdom. Compassion in action is the understanding of a problem or the suffering of another and acting to solve a problem or alleviate the suffering. When you show compassion in action, step outside yourself to do something to connect with others and help better their situation or lives, whether it's physically or mentally. So with something to think about, this is Mrs. Diaz. And this is Miss Oliveira. So make it a great day. Or not, the choice is yours. Thanks, Ms. Diaz, Ms. Oliveira. So, I feel a little better, guys. What have you guys been doing in the community to show your compassion? Well, I know that Washoe County has been a huge help to our community, showing compassion many different ways. Here's Deputy Demo delivering donations to our families. And Maya and Kate and Sebelia were worried about the homeless dogs not having enough food. So they showed their compassion by making dog bags and donating them to a nonprofit. And to show my compassion, I went to Dope Boy Donuts the other day and bought donuts for the employees at Costco. I'm so grateful for all of our grocery workers that are keeping the shelves stocked during this time. Let's take a look and find out all the other ways our Bennett staff is showing their compassion. You can be compassionate by sharing hugs and kind words. Here are some ways to show compassion. Remember to listen to others in how they are feeling. Use kind words. Remember to smile. And share your toys. I am sending love. And I am passing that love on. Thanks for caring. Thanks for sharing. And you can show compassion by calling a friend and telling and asking them how they're doing. We love you guys and we miss you. Compassion of asking your friends if they're okay when they're sad. Does anyone have a flower to brighten my day? I do. Hey, I could really use some toilet paper. You know, I have some right here. <laughs> cool. There you go. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. C. What do you need? Uh, I could use some floss. I got some. Right here. Compassion is also thinking about other people. Instead, instead of buying all of the toilet paper, I could share and not buy all of it. You know what, Ms. Schmidt? Here's some toilet paper for you. You ready? Catch! And then, Mr. Dylan, here's some toilet paper for you, too. Here you go. That's compassion, thinking about other people. Compassion is seeing your friend hurt and trying to make it better.
Oh shoot, wrong way, hold on. <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, it's up there! <laughs> 